Hello there, Dan Eden again. Welcome to episode six of An Intervention Live. I am your host, Dan Eden. We were off uh, a week because uh, the network, Instagram, they said they didn't know if they wanted to renew us. So we got renewed for another season of An Intervention Live on Instagram TV. It's great. I signed the contract. And, and what do we have here? We have someone stopping by. Maybe it's another cast member of the movie. Let's see here. Okay. Let's go live with a certain someone right now. Hello. Hi. <laughs> hey, Kara, how are you? I'm good. How are you? Doing very good. Uh, you know, we got renewed for another season of an intervention live here on Instagram TV. So, you know, things are going really good. Awesome. Uh, thank you for stopping by. I know you've been super busy lately. Uh, how have you been? Um, yeah, just busy, um, you know, living the pandemic life and with a toddler, so <laughs> very busy. <laughs> mm -hmm. uh, well, I just have a few questions for you since you stopped by, since you were nice enough to stop by and talk about an intervention here, the movie that uh, you were nice enough to star in also. And <laughs> um, I guess my first question is, and this is kind of like a an actor interviewee question is, how much of Kara Brinkman is in the role of Marsha Hope? Um, her political side is nowhere anywhere near the role of Marsha Hope. Um, I am, I've, I've, I've personally voted for Bernie Sanders like three times in my life. So right on. Um, I feel like I'm the polar opposite of her. Um, that said, you know, the little bit of like the nerdiness as far as like political history and stuff, definitely, you know, that's definitely a little bit of me, um, just the, the flip side of the coin. <laughs> we, um, I, uh -huh. no, sorry. no, please. Oh, and I have a brother in real life that I think I'm a lot nicer to. So. <laughs> <laughs> that's what I was going to say, actually, um, is that we used a couple photos of you and your brother uh, from when you were kids to simulate you and Henry. And uh, I was going to say, uh, you probably you probably are, are, are nicer to your brother. So that's good. <laughs> uh, okay. Uh, I guess my next question would be, um, how much of an improv background did you have before going into this movie? So I studied uh, improv at Second City. I took, I didn't do their conservatory, but I took a bunch of the other classes there um, and then studied some. Um, and then I was in um, your shows at uh, Gorilla Tango Theater for... A few That's right. years, more years than I realized. I realized that I met you guys almost a decade ago, maybe a little bit more. Yeah, um, it's pretty cool. So, yeah, it's crazy. Um, so yeah, and then I've done a couple of um, just like small plays, more scripted. But um, I think there's a lot of improv that goes into method acting and scripted acting because you kind of have to work out character, but pre, you know, getting your lines and working through them. So definitely, definitely, yeah, had had a pretty decent improv background. That's good. Yeah, because I know we kind of threw you into it with like nonstop improv. Just show up to the set. You got the loose story beats, you know. Yeah, I think I had a sheet of like my bio. And then I just remember being like, like, okay, like, who is who? And I want to make sure like I, had, I knew my relationship with, with everybody like, like, really well. Um, yeah, it was it was it was fun. It was an experience. <laughs> Do you remember that day? Like, it was like what 2013 so <laughs> yeah it was a while ago um yeah i mean i remember we were out, we were out in the suburbs um filming in, in a house um i remember i had like a time i had to like like show up at two o'clock and there was no it was, there was no pre it's not like i showed up and like had my makeup done or like got to hang out it was kind of just like knock on the door and there's gonna be a camera in your face so uh <laughs> yeah it was it was i remember walking over and being like okay like 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 marcia hope this is my story this is who's gonna greet me and then just hoping everything worked out it's it's almost like a test or a quiz or something a little <laughs> bit yeah <laughs> um we we uh i took a, we took a week off here from kind of marketing this movie and the reason is because i had to prep for our shoot on saturday <laughs> uh without giving away too much of the next movie uh let's talk about the character you play in the next movie a little bit what kind of a person is she she's a little timid um a nervous timid girl she's very I, I call her a girl because even though she's in her 30s i don't know if she's fully become a woman um <laughs> may, maybe she develops into one you know maybe okay. um but she uh yeah a little shy a little timid a little unsure of herself just trying to 
find her place in the world. Um, but driven, driven to, to do, to, to, to achieve her goals. Do you, uh, enjoy playing the more antagonistic role or more of the kind of protagonist, uh, the one in this newer one kind of? Um, personally, I mean, it's always fun to do either, but I really love being the antagonist. (laughs) (laughs) I think it's a lot more fun to be the villain and to, to just like, I don't know, just to, like I just want to like mess with people like I'm really nice in real life so I think it's like a way for me to get out I think I'm nice anyways I don't know my husband you are? No, absolutely. might tell you something else but um I like to um yeah I, I, I like to um it, it's 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 a good way to let out like any any aggressions <laughs> <laughs> sure sure um so is that is there any character like if you were to cast yourself or write yourself any role and maybe you have in the past but uh, what kind of character would you want to play? The ideal role that you would want to play? Or have you played it already? I I have not. I would love to play, like, like somebody kind of crazy. Mm-hmm. Like, with, like, a knife who's, like, I don't know. Like, not, like, trying to kill somebody, but just somebody trying to... <laughs> that's my daughter screaming in the background you can hear. Um, no, that's okay. <laughs> um... <laughs> Just, um, yeah, just somebody a little, like, nuts, like, a little unhinged, kind of, like, maybe, like, in a mental asylum, just, like, mm-hmm. like, kind of just going kind of crazy and just has, like, a, like, a, like, a maybe a psychosis or something. I think that would be a lot of fun. Okay, cool. Yeah. <laughs> like, a, like, a girl interrupted kind of thing, right? Kind of, yeah, yeah. <laughs> um, very cool. Um, I guess that's all the questions I had for you. I want to thank you for stopping by here. Um, we did re- release the uh, Blu-ray just yesterday. So physical copies of the movie are now out for intervention. Yes, um, everyone unfortunately, go buy them. <laughs> yeah, they're, they're, they're hard to come by though. Like they're, they're, they, they left as soon as they came, unfortunately, but they're on back order on Amazon. So. Um, well, that's good, that. sold out, that's great. <laughs> <laughs> and then uh, I'll have to talk again. I'm trying to get a, a whole group chat with uh, the whole cast of Intervention, J- not just one-on-one, but the whole uh, entire cast in the near future. So uh, we could do that, and that'd be great. And uh, thank you for stopping by on Intervention Live. Yeah, thank you for having me. Take care, all right? We'll talk to you all soon. Right. All right, bye-bye. Bye-bye. All right, guys, you take care. Thank you for watching Intervention Live. Thank you, Kara, for stopping by. Uh that's it. We'll see you next time. Uh, I don't think we're quite over. I mean, we just renewed our contract with Instagram TV. They were going to cancel us just last week. We had to have the negotiations. So I'm glad that that all worked out. I'm glad we all signed on the dotted line and everything's going to continue. So who knows? Maybe someone else will stop by. We still got a few people to talk to in the uh, cast and crew of uh, my finger keeps fading in and out. Intervention. Uh intervention there it is but yeah check out uh, wherever you can google intervention 2021 maybe and intervention blu-ray uh there are some retailers out there but uh, i understand there's a lot of back orders going on unfortunately so get the blu-ray while you can and uh we'll, we'll talk to you soon we got plenty more content we haven't stopped yet all right bye guys